website. Special Christmas deliveries at Navy Pier today. It wasn't Santa Claus, but the Coast Guard that brought fresh Christmas trees from across Lake Michigan. WGN's Sean Lewis has more on the Chicago Christmas ship making its annual trip. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle At Navy Pier this weekend, the Coast Guard Cutter Mackinac. Its decks decked with trees, signaling its seasonal duty as Chicago's Christmas ship. We're partnering with about 100 other not-for-profits, churches, and local communities, and schools. Ada S. McKinley Community Services is leading the volunteer operation at Navy Pier. This year, 1,200 trees from Upper Michigan made the journey. Volunteers from across the area, including students from Lincoln Way Central High School, loading them onto trucks to be delivered to families in need over the next couple of weeks. We're having a good time, and the weather is holding up really well. I'm just pleased that we're able to honor the legacy of the, the boats that have come across Lake Michigan before us. Take home all those who have been lost at sea. This is now the 22nd year for the modern Christmas ship, a reenactment of sorts of Chicago's original Christmas tree ships from the late 19th and early 20th centuries. The final journey was November 1912, when the Ralph Simmons, under the command of Herman Schoenemann, Captain Santa, as he was known, sank to the bottom of Lake Michigan, overloaded with 5,000 trees. The current ship providing a happier tale. All right, let's go. Come on. Thank you. A service by the U.S. Coast Guard and the volunteers who come out every year. It's such a great event. You know, it's such a great event. Being a, uh, an icebreaker and an aton cutter, we don't get a ton of opportunities to directly interact with the public. And uh, as part of aton, this is a great break for the crew to come on in, get a chance to see some smiling faces. You can hear the Christmas music in the background right now. Uh, this is a really great opportunity for the crew to give back. Giving back to ensure that everyone who celebrates it can have a Merry Christmas at Navy Pier. Sean Lewis, WGN News.